Good morning, everybody, and welcome back. Time now is 626. Thanks for being with us this morning. The works of artist Ted DeGrazia are known around the world and certainly right here in the Old Pueblo. Last year, the DeGrazia's Chapel, built in the 50s, caught on fire. But as News 4 Tucson's Zach Briggs tells us, they're getting closer to repairing the space. He joins us live now from the DeGrazia Gallery with more. Zach, good morning. Good morning. The chapel's been closed to the public for several months, but now there are plans in place to restore this piece of artistic history. Memorial Day 2017, emberine prayer candles destroyed the chapel built by artist Ted de Grazia over 60 years ago. The Mission at the Sun's adobe structure still intact, although heavily damaged. Tokens of goodwill, often left by visitors, survived. Several murals scorched. We probably lost 70%, uh, uh, and what's left is quite smoke damaged, but we'll do our best to clean it up and um, just go from there. Lance Labor, the Grazia Gallery Executive Director, hopes restoration of the chapel begins toward the end of this month or in March. Labor is also seeking input from the National Register of Historic Places on how to go about bringing back to life such an iconic piece of Tucson's past. De Grazia was uh, probably the most uh, famous artist to ever uh, come out of uh, Arizona and Tucson. It's really a, a, a little place that's in people's hearts. People like Mary and Gary Major from Missouri, both shocked after learning what happened to the chapel last May. We were devastated. The Majors visit the Old Pueblo every year. They're longing for the day when the Mission at the Sun will be finally restored, returning from the ashes. It's wonderful. We enjoy the landscape, the gallery. We've always enjoyed seeing the church. It's, it's beautiful here. And Lance Labor tells me that there is a rededication ceremony scheduled for December of the Mission at the Sun. We're now we're live at the foothills. Zach Briggs, News for Tucson Today.